Miami-Dade County will have a new property appraiser in less than a year. And uh, former Miami mayor just announced he is running for the position. Yeah, his opponent is someone who has tried to get the post in the past. CBS News Miami's Yvonne Taylor asked him the question we want to know. For years, the Miami-Dade property appraiser election has been nonpartisan, but changes to the Florida Constitution will make the 2024 election a contest where candidates will have to be registered to a political party. A Republican former Miami mayor, Tomas Regalado, wants to be the next Miami-Dade property appraiser. I think that the most consequential crisis that we have now is housing. A Democrat appraiser, Marisol Centeno, who ran in 2020, is running again. The office hasn't improved. We still have so many inefficiencies, Ivan. Current Miami-Dade property appraiser, 86-year-old Pedro Garcia, is not running for re-election after three consecutive terms. That's not the only change. This office now uh, responds to Miami-Dade County government. It will not do that uh, beginning of 2025. We're going to be independent uh, from the mayor and from the uh, commissioners. 57-year-old Centeno works at the appraiser's office. She lost to Garcia three years ago. The property assessor's office establishes taxable values for all properties in Miami-Dade. What is exactly your platform? Increase the homestead exemption. $25,000 has been on the book for 50 years is no longer viable. 76-year-old Regalado understands Tallahassee is the one that can change that because homestead exemption applies to all the state of Florida. We have to do a referendum uh, statewide. Customer service. We need to help the customers. We need to help the taxpayer understand how they can save, how they can avoid the pitfalls. Centeno has been a local activist and an appraiser for over three decades. Regalado is a veteran television and radio journalist who served as mayor of Miami for two terms. People would say he did an excellent job, but we now need new blood. What do you say to that? I tell them that experience counts. I tell them that I have accumulated uh, knowledge about knowing people in every single city in Miami-Dade County. I have a great relationship with the state legislature. How do you reply to that? I've been appraising properties in Miami-Dade County for over 30 years. We need an appraiser at the office of the property appraiser, not a politician. So two candidates are participating in this election so far, one Democrat, one Republican, but more can register, and the deadline for that is June 2024. In downtown Miami, I'm Ivan Taylor, CBS News, Miami.